Welcome to NTC Reviews. Today, I'm going to be talking about this new case that I picked up by Urban Armor Gear for my new MacBook Pro with the M1 chip in it. Previous to this MacBook, I had the late 2013 MacBook Pro. I had gone through several cases, came across UAG, saw that they were military spec, and uh, I was sick of having cracked cases, whether I was out in the field, whether I was traveling on a plane. It just seemed like everything else that was available just wasn't cutting it for those of us with an active lifestyle. So when I came across UAG, saw their specs, saw their uh, military spec drop test certification, I knew I had to get my hands on it. Now, I used that case for years, actually reviewed that case, was extremely happy with it, and I still have it. As you could tell, it's been through some stuff. So by having this case this whole time on my old MacBook Pro, I was able to trade it in, get some good money for it because it was still like new. Picked up this new guy, I knew that I had to get a UAG case for it. I looked on the website, saw that they made it for this particular model, went ahead and picked it up. You wanna learn a little bit more about this case? Stay tuned. This case is super light. As I mentioned, military spec as far as their drop test, which of course is super important because we're always banging these things against something, or at least I know that I am. So uh, to be honest with you, I waited a couple days after I bought the MacBook to receive my UAG case, and I was cradling my MacBook Pro and just holding it close to me and making sure I wasn't gonna get any scratches or drop it or ding it against the wall. And uh, as soon as the case came in the mail, I quickly put it right on my MacBook. It locks, okay, so there's this dual locking mechanism. So as I go ahead and open it up, as you can tell when I do close it, it snaps into place. So great feature, something that I didn't find in any other case that I've bought and or reviewed in the past. Even my phone has a UAG protective case. Now these new MacBook Pros with the M1 chip do run a bit hot. That's one thing that I've noticed. I've had it for a couple weeks now and there is no fan in these MacBooks. And as I have it on my desk and I'm editing video all day and pictures and uh, things like that, so it's continually working. And it does get a bit hot to the touch. Now what I do like about this case is if you notice, when I do open it up, It lifts a bit here okay so not only is it good for ergonomically so that you can see everything allowing the vents on the bottom of this case to do their job and keep the MacBook cool excellent feature now I'm always bouncing around and usually this is the backpack that I have with me where I keep my camera equipment as well as my laptop and now that I know that it has all of this protection I can easily just slip it into my backpack, into the sleeve that most backpacks out there offer, especially conveniently with a 13 inch. Close that up and know that I have peace of mind protecting not only my workhorse, but my investment. This case is super simple to put on. Basically start at the bottom, get the bottom in, make sure your laptop's open, snap the top part into place, go ahead, close it down, snap it and you're good to go to take the case off basically you're going to reverse that you'll start with the uh, top corner get that loosened up just work your way around that top surface to the other side or to the other bumper and go ahead and just pry that back a bit get it loose and the case comes off super easy so bottom line if you're in the market for a protective case for your macbook as well as pretty much any other laptop out there on the market definitely take a look at these Urban Armor Gear Protective cases. They've sold me for quite a few years now, and if they keep doing what they're doing, they will have my business pretty much forever. 